marginal utility will be constant. You take the small, next is when you take that one, when the increasing returns are 10, when you are taking the 10 and 20, your total returns 9, 19, the marginal returns also 9, 10. Increasing stage of software, but here you are changing that one. When you are applying the 30, the total units are 30, the marginal rate is 11. Now we are taking this like a 40 units or lakhs, whatever it is. The total units 41, then marginal rate 11. Means when you are applying the first stage in the 10, 20. The total returns and the marginal utility will be increased. Okay, so same thing that one. When you apply the 30 and the 40, that one, the total is in 30 and 41, but here marginal returns will be constant. There is no change at all. Here 11 and 11. Any changing is there? There is no changing. But here this this curve we are going to that. R2, R1. But R2, when you are comparing the R2, S, yes, there is no change at all. It's going to this constant. When you are same thing applying that one, 50 and a 60, then uh, what will happen? Marginal will be diminishing. Sir, is there now? Here also 9 is 10, is there now? But stages, I am saying that one. That is the first stage. Not this. This is the first stage. This is the start, third stage when you are compared with the stages will be differences is there yes now second stage is completely constant third stage what will happen diminishing the marginal productivity also diminish okay the causes of the increasing and the decreasing then what will happen we have the resources we have the labor and the capital we can utilize it. For example, like a machinery, management, and etc. can't be divided you divided into small units. The capital and the management, if it is possible, if it is not possible to divide it in a small. Okay, it's a big size things. That's what I am saying. Understood. Then what 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 we have to do do to divide the factors variable such as a variable you can divide it no problem at all. We can changing that one according to situation, according to production, according to situation also we can change it. But some factors we can't change. It's a long time period point of view I am seeing. When you are taking invest the capital, like a machinery, plant, we can't change in a short term period. Because it is a capital when, when you are purchase the machinery, tools, plants, whatever it is, it is give for a longer period of time. It is not a apply to the short term period. Understood. So whatever it is, you have to utilize the factors to care to utilize that one, either short period or longer period. In cause, causes of diminishing, the form expand the size and the expenditure certain the economics only up to a certain level of output. So in any industries, they can increase in certain stage only. Then increasing returns certain stage after that one output and uh, marginal utility will be decreasing okay this is the return to scale so next topic is economics scales or economic scales or economics scales economics scale economic scale so here what 
do you mean by economy scale? The economy it is a large scale production to be grouped under the heading. They are the two types of economies are there, namely internal economy, external economies. Internal economies, internal and uh, external economies. Now we are going to discuss about that internal economies. internal economies and uh, external economies. So what do you mean by internal economies? What is that? So internal economies, it is that used by the donate the limitation of the economies to be form A itself. And uh, more according to that pay Morses, they are giving the definition of internal economies those are the which is the open this single factor digits it is applied to the single factory single industry single form it is applicable to the only single digits there is there is not possible to the group of institutions the large scale institutions it is only applicable to the single digits single thing the form internal economics results and uh, from the increasing of the scale of output of a form can't be achieved the, unless the output increasing because it is the single unit now it is never achieved the increasing output because so many drawbacks so many low fulls are there if form is increasing or decreasing by the factors, you would take the help of the factors, so secondary. If your form is small, the output, it is not possible to increasing, increasing immediately. Okay, that too, I am saying that one, is an economics production, that one, which is thus, occur the itself of thus, expand the output, encouraging the scale production, in short, they, Arise simply to do increase in little to scale production. So the types of internal economies are there. The form experience of the following that one. We have that different kinds of internal economies are there. First is technical economies. Please concentrate. Internal economies, it is a single form. It is single form, external big form, large form. Okay. So output, okay, we take the help of the factors of production or the output, but it can't achieve the goal. We can't achieve the maximum output which one internal economies so the form experience of the following that one we have the types of internal economies are there <coughs> types of internal economies first is technical economies okay so what do you mean by technical economies technical is the effort of the 
return to scale large form they can using all type of things they don't bother about the lack of capital they can using whatever it is they making goods and service to the output they can take help of the technology and the machinery and the manpower also they can using and the whatever it is making the productivity they are considered skillful labor the almost all they can take the help of this machinery technology also but the internal economic point of view internal economics point of view it is not possible to the internal economics because it is a small scale industry it is a small it is a single form then they are facing lack of capital also they are facing technology they don't bother they always bother about the machineries manpower and the management also is one of the drawback from that they can't achieve the their goals they can't achieve the output maximally understood so what is this <coughs> and uh, the production of this large size of machinery linking and uh, proper linking making superior techniques supervising so many things or reason the specialization okay and the next is marginal economy marginal economics so marginal economics means what the increasing scale of production they can benefit pressing the marginal department each department under the change of the exports which one it is possible to the large scale not small scale are the different different departments are there in from the departments we have the experts they can appoint it it is small scale we can't be afford this specialization because they are facing capital lack of capital so management so everything is they can suffering from that which is scale small scale only it is not applicable to the large scale small scale they are facing in so many problems we can't make additional productivity we can't take help of the technology and uh, we can't be it depends upon machinery system also that is the drawback <coughs>